Hello, my name is Matthew Fraley, founder of BreakpointTrades.com. As you know, we've been bringing advanced technical analysis, market commentary, trade ideas, and advanced mechanical trading systems algorithms since 2003. And that's what I'm going to discuss in this video today instead of the general market. So let's go to the systems section. We have various systems. We have our new famous KISS systems. As you know, they're trend following systems. They're actually long only. We follow over 630 instruments. We have various baskets. Um, the systems email you whenever there's a new change to your favorites. And you can see these really nice gains, percentage gains. Um, the systems have really done well. They're very popular. They're mechanical, etc. But again, we're not going to discuss those today. The topic of today's topic is actually our SPY and ES mean reversion systems. So they're opposite of trend following. They are mean reversion, which means, you know, they look for areas when the market gets overextended, either to the upside or the downside. Um, and there's a st statistical odds of a snapback. You know, it's kind of like a rubber band gets too stretched and it snaps back into place back to the mean. That's what the mean reversion systems do. Here's a graphic I made up you know, months ago, but it shows these individual mean reversion systems. So mean reversion systems, some of you may be familiar with them uh, regarding, you know, Larry Connors. He made it famous with his RSI 2 system, where if you're in an uptrend above the 200-day moving average, if the two-length RSI falls below 10%, you take a trade. And if you know, price goes back above a short-term moving average or the RSI 2 gets back overbought, then you exit. Same thing for shorts. So instead of just having one mean reversion system, over the years, I made a whole basket of them. They all do different things. You can see the various names, trend pullback, pullback, RSI oversold, RSI 14 reversal, S-trap, stochastic. Now, there's actually 22 systems here instead of 21. The breakout I included on here, but it's not um, it's not a mean reversion system. It's actually, you know, they occur on breakout to new highs, all right? But all the others are mean reversion, okay? And there's 21 of them, and they all have very high statistics, typically 80, 90% winning trades. They are in cash most of the time. They're not trying to ride out entire trends, so I hope that's, it should be obvious. They're just trying to capture some alpha a statistical edge in the market whenever the market gets over extremely overbought or extremely oversold due for some sign of mean reversion. Anyway, um, these system trades are in the SPY and the, again, they're in the SPY and ES systems. They're in the, we have a tab for SPY trades and for ES trades. And you can see we have a couple open for the new year. We actually have three open systems for ES. We have one open for the SPY. So that's what I want to talk about today because a few of these went long last week on ES, the trend pullback, S-trap, and QE Momo all went long. And on SPY, the S-trap and trend pullback went long. So let's take a look at these systems individually. So this is from TradeStation. These are these systems that I have open. So we have the SPY mean reversion systems, the longs. I have two workspace for the longs. You can see the various trades. And you can see up here, the uh, QE3 Momo went long last week. It is still long at the moment. If you look though, it's actually looking to close out today. So this system is actually looking out to close out today. These, Mo, these Momo trades tend to be very short term. They occur whenever, say, a 60 stochastic is embedded above 80%, then you get a short term oscillator getting oversold. They have high statistics, but again, they don't have huge winning trades because they're short term, but they tend to have very high winning percentage trades. So let's take a look at the stats here. All right, so here's the statistics. So this one has a profit factor of 80, which is exceptional. That means for every dollar it lost, it made 80 bucks. You can see the gross loss, $84 versus gross profit, 6,400. That's how it, you compute the profit factor. Almost 90% winning trades. Um, again, doesn't trade a lot. And if we look at the um, 
the, number, the time in trades, average time is anywhere around four days, four to five days. So it's not in trades very long, obviously. Very nice profit curve, but that system is looking to exit today. Um, late last year in November, we had the breakout that caught a trade. Now, unfortunately, we missed this on the website because we've been so involved in our KISS trend systems. I saw it after the fact and I was hoping for a pullback and the market never did, but it did make a nice trade there, as you can see. Um, looking at the other ones, here's the other spy longs. So here's the S trap and the long trend pullback. Again, they all went long last week. We went long last week on Friday morning. So it was a pretty good entry. So here's the S trap. Again, that tends to be another short term trade. Let's take a look at the statistics. Profit factor of 19.8, excellent. 88.5% winning trades, 96% 96 trades overall. Trade history, again, goes back to the 1990s. Very nice profit factor. You can see the first trade back there in 1996. And uh, average time on this trade is about four to five days. So again, another short term. This is also looking to exit today. Again, it's not going to be a huge winner, but will be a profitable trade if it exits today. And the trend also went long last week. Now, that is not looking to exit today. Now, the profit, the stats on this one, it makes more money over time, but it um, it doesn't exit as, as easily. So this one, profit factor about 9.5, 87.5. 7% winning trades, 200 trades, so trades quite a bit. Average time in trades, a little bit longer, seven to eight days. Nice profit curve. All right, taking a look at the ES systems. Again, we run the same 21 mean reversion systems on ES. So here's ES and none on this page. Okay, go to the next one. So in this ES system page, you can see the uh, the trend is long, similar stats to the S&P. I got a couple versions of it here. Um, it is also not looking to exit today. The QE Momo is also long here. And by the way, it's not looking to exit yet today. All right. And the S trap is long as well. It's also not looking to exit. Very decent, st good stats on these. Let's take a look. Let's take a look at the S-trap here. Again, nice profit curve. 13 profit factor, 89, 90% winning trades. Okay. So that's what's looking at, guys. Um, again, we have several subsystems that are long on both ES, MES. MES is the micro contract on ES and SPY. Some of these SPY trades are looking to exit today. Looks like none of these ES systems are looking to exit yet. And as far as shorts, again, we also have a variety of shorts, but none of these have been triggering. None of these have traded last year, really, or even recently. Again, you know, a lot of these short systems trigger in bear markets or when you're below the 200-day moving average, which we're way away from. The only short systems that can occur in this type of market might be the exhaustion short, which you see here, again, that's a very rare type of trade. You got to be, even though we had a hell of a rally from the late October lows into late December, it wasn't enough to trigger that. So you can see that, you know, these do, they only, tr they rarely trigger and the market's got to be just crazily overbought to trigger. So none of these are triggered on SPY or ES. You can see the this one exhaustion short on SPY, only nine trades in, you know, 34 years. So it doesn't trade very much, 100% winners. So none of the shorts have triggered. Again, guys, that will do a trade notification email. Okay, again, that does it. Thank you for watching my YouTube series. Thank you for being a patron, subscriber, supporter of Breakpoint Trades. If you're not a subscriber, continue consider just subscribing. We have an amazing service here and a community. Some of our members have been here for almost 20 years. All right, take care.